Well, in Lithuania, we tend to say that students study only law or business. But I invite on the stage Juan Coro from Utah, who would love to share with us what are the key five future jobs which we should go to study for. So, Juan is the director of the engineering area in Utah, which is the first university that is specialized in training in the major areas associated with the value chain in digital economy. So his topic, five jobs of the future and how to study for them. Juan, welcome to Lithuania. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. It's going to be tough. Uh, it's four o'clock. You are very tired all today. I wear the only tie or the few ties that are around here. I am speaking English. Uh, I'm not talking about video games, so it's going to be tough. I, 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 I wish you can help me to enjoy a little bit what we are talking about. OK. Uh, I was asked to, to talk about uh, future jobs. What are we going to see in the next years about jobs? Uh, who I am? I am Juan Corro. Uh, uh, I am right now academic director for engineering in a, some kind of strange Spanish university, private university. Uh, uh, I am engineer, I'm a politician, uh, I am father of three little kids, any other businesses I might have, and uh, I don't really know who I am. But for, for, for just giving you some small points about me, and in my Twitter you will find this presentation and all the things I will jump to. Uh, in order to see what to do, it's, it's good to at least look or think about what the future will look like. And I don't know, what do you think the future will look like? Uh, just give it a second. Uh, I, I will give you my, my quick answer from a university from Spain. I think the future will be a mess. It's not very complicated, but something like this will be probably the future. We, we move in a place and in a time where uncertainty is going to be bigger and bigger and tougher and tougher to be oriented, to be in the same job for the whole life, or to be sure about what skills or what exactly tools you need for a, a given day. It will be a mess. Uh, how do you see your future job? That is the future. So you see the future, and what are you going to be in the middle of that crazy supermarket? Uh, for, for me, uh, and it's the basic of uh, and the roots of our university, it will be digital, or digitalized somehow. There will be a few jobs or a few things you will do, uh, mainly without any digital experience. But uh, table football, which is having a great hit today in the middle of, the, of this switch it. Uh, there are lots of technology, but the, the football table is always fully booked. Uh, but there is a warning. I would like you to, to warn something which is very important. Uh, about When you think about the future, about your future job, it's very important not to be robotized. Uh, this is quite important. In the UK, they are very worried about this because the 40 percent of the current UK labor force is under risk uh, because it will be or can be or might be robotized, automated, or any other ways of doing that. Uh, they study that only 13 percent, so 87 percent of the creative workers are at low or no risk of robotization. So this is first tooltip. Uh, I, I will, I will, there is a, a test uh, I would like to, to do with you. This is Nesta web page. This is a, an amazing charity they have in the, in the UK. Oh, they have, this is not Mirror. You, it's round here. Oh, let me. This is getting harder. Uh, let, 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 let take the quiz about if we are going to be robotized in our year. First question. In my role, I need skills to learn effectively 
I would say yes. Uh, I agree. Otherwise, everything is changing, and I don't know exactly what to do next. Uh, next question. Let's follow the quiz. Oh, this this ma makes things harder. If I am in English with Thai and speaking about jobs, and I put an exam, this is not helping. Okay, let's see if we can make it through. Uh, in my role, I need the skills to solve new or badly defined problems in complex real-world settings. Uh, this is a university. I slightly agree. I agree because we are something new. Uh, let's see. Third question. In my role, I need the skills to design, set up, operate, and correct malfunctions with machineries or technological systems. Well, really, no. No, I, I don't fix things. Uh, I mean, technically. Uh, fourth question. In my role, I need the skills to decide how money, time, people, and material should be efficiently allocated. Yes, that is. That's strongly true. Only two more questions about if we are going to be robotized or not. I made this before in order to, to look nice here. OK, there's some tricky things when you know the answers and the questions. So next one, please. In my role, I need the skills to understand, monitor, and improve technical or management systems. That is slightly agree. And the last one, in my role, I need the skills to work closely with people to achieve goals, including persuading, understanding, negotiating, and teaching people. I would say strongly agree, or at least I should. And at the very result, I hope this isn't changed since yesterday, uh, I shouldn't be in a high risk of robotizing. But uh, uh, the, the reason why I, I wanted to bring this test with you is to, to realize about what, does, uh, what do the, those questions mean and what are the implications for, for the decision-making process. Uh, this is finished. It should be finished. And it will say, I am OK, I am safe, and I can have my salary back every month for now. Well, let's say it is OK. You can trust me. I hope so. So after testing that, first tip, the, the first tool tip you should or can take home, be creative. That, that, that's easy. You, 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 don't, you haven't learned much here. But it's important you to, to understand and realize about those things. Uh, what does the labor market look like today? Uh, this is something very nice. This is made by an engineer, OK? Not that nice as Nesta's work. Uh, this is an analysis, a topic analysis, made of 7,000 ICT jobs in Spain. And with the clustering algorithm LDA, bah, something. You can see there how jobs are merging in the ICT sector. Uh, the European Commission says, I will make a, a deeper look later, that by 2020, 825,000 vacancies in ICT jobs uh, will be needed in Europe, only in Europe. Uh, I don't know if there is a, anyone from the Commission. Uh, I don't trust really what the, the numbers the, the Commission says. They are usually hyped. But let's say it is not 80, 800,000, but it will be some 100,000, which is quite a huge amount. Uh, I, will, I will show you. You can, in my Twitter account, I have just, uh, let, I have to move this. This is uh, what you can find there. And you, you, what you do have here is you have the skills. And this is the biggest percentage of ICT jobs in Spain last year. In those 7,000 in the biggest uh, portals is this, this is a Java developer, a developer for Java software or things like that. Uh, and you can see here Java, J2EE, a Spring, Web, Eclipse, and so on. Here you have marketing, communication. So online marketing is going to be hot still for the next 
uh, for the next years, for sure, if everything is going digital. That's easy to know. This is a web page uh, designer. So I recommend you to go to that link, uh, deep inside a little bit on those skills. And in case you are willing to have some ICT-related job, maybe that gives you some tooltips in order to go on studying for the next time. OK. So you can test it. And there's the link there. Uh, so we saw what looked like the future, maybe the future job, robotize, and the market. And now I would like to introduce you uh, OODA loop, which is something we all learned from the Second World War, uh, which is a cycle made of observe, orient, decide, and act, uh, made after they study how the best fighter, uh, plane, aer aeroplane fighter A's were performing top. So when they analyze that cycle and see how long do you take to observe, orient, decide, and go, that period of time, the shorter it is, the, most, the more probabilities you have to, to, to be an ace in the sky, in, in the Second World War. And that's still true. If we are going in to be in a complex world uh, with a lot of uncertainty, we need to, to observe, orient, decide, and act. Uh, I will try to be with you and, and to go with you in the, in, the, in the following minutes about how do we, or at least what do I see, in order to share what I see uh, in, this, in this kind of things related to jobs. The orientation, the decision, and acting is on your hand. Okay, I will, I will do one thing, and you will do three things in case you want. Observe. Let's observe. I observe that software is everywhere. Everywhere I look around, uh, I see every, every single thing in my life is going uh, digitalized and is going uh, deeply with software links. So, first. A uh, tooltip you could do if software is, every, is everywhere, and that is, uh, next week is, will, it will be the European Code Week. So learn to code is, is a, an idea. Maybe you can find something interesting there. Uh, and don't miss the cloud, OK? Uh, cloud is, revolution, uh, is a revolution also for developers, because everything is, programming, uh, is programmable. You can program almost everything from the hardware to the software and the network. So uh, think on coding and think on cloud. Uh, design is everywhere. That's something that, uh, that, that we, we should have learned yet. The most valuable company in the world is Apple. And the thing you could say there is, I love those guys. Uh, it's because they are pretty. They are beautiful. They are nice. So the design is everywhere, love the beauty. And if you want to do something like that, digitalize, fine arts, digital, make, make something user experience very advanced, very engaging. That is something I observe, and it's around there. And you can think about if you find yourself fitable in this idea. Third, everything is interactive. Everything is moving more and more interactive. You, 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 you can do more things with more devices, with more uh, 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 schemes, more platform, more apps. Even the windows are, are becoming interactive walls. Uh, so, so you are going to test. Uh, in order to be interactive, video games is a huge interactive uh, scheme which has uh, passed strongly the film industry. The video games industry is much higher in volume in annual revenues than the film industry. So try it. Every, every time you can try, try it, because new kinds of interactive, uh, uh, interactive actions can deliver ideas and things. So you can try to, to be one person doing things in this world, because if it's going to be more and more interactiveness, maybe you will find a job the, where you can fit your skills. Uh, another thing I see is that as everyone, everything is digitalized, uh, there is a lot of interactivity. Uh, everything uh, is going to multiple devices. So I see data is everywhere. Uh, and it's all what Google is about and many other things is about. And data is something tricky. The more data you have, the, th the more difficult it becomes to, to treat it and to, to do something interesting with that. So data 
is everywhere, and maybe you can find your space there uh, in, a, in that analyst, that architect, or even in visualizing uh, uh, things. I would like, uh, there is a, a Spanish company called CartoDB, which is uh, a top data visualization company ma made in huge and amazing maps. View, uh, being able to view data is not very easy, it's very creative, and it's something that is uh, skyrocketing. Data is everywhere, and you could find eventually your job there. Uh, content is the king. Uh, there were a time in the past where we thought that we will have one single hardware and different content through hardware. One in the living room, one in the computer, and, and another one. There were mini series only for mobile, three seconds, 10 second mini series. Uh, there were uh, specific content for consoles, uh, I mean, uh, film con uh, content, and we, we saw that when the time passed, the technological uh, revolution came, and more and more devices, stronger uh, computing co uh, capabilities came up. So we, at the end, see the same content, top quality content, those TV movies, TV series, or football matches, or whatever we like, basketball matches. I am from Spain. I will not make any other father comment in Lithuania related basketball, OK, I promise. Uh, so we will enjoy the same, uh, the same content we like, and content is the king uh, in many forms, in forms and many devices. Another thing we, I see, or I, can, I would like to share with you as what things I, I see, or from my viewpoint, what, 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 thing, what I think is trending, is that security is a hot topic. Keep safe is, a, is something that is getting more and more important when you go digital, everything is interconnected, all your data, photos, and all the old things are there. And remember that one. Uh, do you remember that film? Uh, the interview is a Sony picture related to North Korea. They were hacked, and uh, it was a huge hype in the world. So that's another thing is, is uh, as you are closer, or at least in the digital sphere, uh, you will need to be safe. And lots of things are happening here in cybersecurity, uh, and helping people about their privacy, or mm, trying to keep safe your data. That will be something that is increasing, uh, and that's something that you might find your future job there. Uh, there is another thing. I am an engineer. I, I enjoy doing funny things, uh, do things that are enjoyable. I really don't care much. There is one member of my board over there, so don't listen. He is looking at his phone. So uh, someone has to make money, okay? Not only enjoying, I try to enjoy the more, the most I can, but someone has to make money. So. Uh, it can run uh, so the business can run longer. And that's something that we will find in the future. Maybe the uh, business administration, bachelors or things will digitalize somehow, more, be more interactive, more data driven, but it's something you will find there. Uh, and something that, that, that makes your project profitable in this digital world. And there's another one. I really don't like much the, the next slide. But I have to do that because otherwise I wouldn't be that clear uh, or frank to you. Uh, and it's the law is everywhere. Everywhere. Everywhere you look at, there is law, regulation, and things like that. So you are still you will need lawyers in the future. Bad luck. We will not get lo less lawyers in the future, but probably more and more specialized. Uh, it's something we, we, we have to, to, to think about because that, that is something important. Uh, I'm not in the lawyer industry, but as a politician, they make laws, so maybe I am also involved in this thing. Uh, so that's, that's what we think in, in Utah, and that, that's what we do. Sometimes you, 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 you can know uh, or understand others by listening to them and say, do this, do that. As a parent, I know what I'm saying about. And the other thing you can do is observe what they do. And sometimes they are the same, that is coherent, and sometimes they are not. We in, in Utah, we try to follow what we observe as trending. We are a university focused mainly in the digital economy, OK? So we have software engineer, undergraduate, digital arts, uh, video game design, animation, and business administration. So we did 
everything we could to keep current on our vision. Uh, only thing we don't have is lawyers. No, we, we don't know how to do that. It's something we, we didn't do. Uh, and in, in postgraduate, only in the, in the engineering area, we have video games, uh, postgraduate, and animation postgraduates, and arts postgraduate. But in, and in my area, we have b big data and analytics, cybersecurity, advanced software, virtual reality, and cloud computing. That's what we do related to what we observe. And that's what I wanted to share with you today in order to see if you observe the same things about the future, about what you want to do, and what will you do in your OODA cycle. So that was what I wanted to share with you. Thank you very much. You have my contact details here. And I would like to uh, try to, to open a conversation where you can say what you say or what you see in this area. We open the floor. Yes, my mic is there. So any question you would join, you would love to ask still? No. You see, the conversation was I'm done. I'm so sorry. <laughs> the conversation done. Then thank you, Juan. Round of applause for Juan.